I got an engine. I got another engine. I got another engine in the other side of the shop. I have engines all over the place right now. So I just wanted to bring a quick clip, just a little stream, not, not stream, but you know, just a quick clip here. Uh, I wanted to kind of ask you guys, what do you want to know? So right now I have several engines. This is a small block Chevy. This is actually a high performance engine. You can see I got the ceramic coated pistons and I'm not really doing much of a video on that, but if there's anything specific you'd like me to talk about on that engine, I can do so. This guy here is one I am doing footage on. This is a 2018 Coyote, so new Mustang. And this guy is going twin turbos, so we're getting a bunch of boost put onto this thing. And you can see I have a bunch of parts sitting here. Uh, one of the things, for instance, the crankshaft here, it's actually a factory crankshaft, but it's been cryo-treated to make it stronger. So, you know, stock crankshaft is not quite enough for this build. So we're gonna, we had that one cryo-treat. And then we also have connecting rods in that box there. I think these are head gaskets right here. Uh, bearings, of course, I have to make sure all those are clearance properly, things like that. What else do I have here? I don't even know what this box is. Uh, looks like some kind of a catch can system. And then here are the pistons themselves. Now these are something a little unique. Now this is all customer ordered. Sorry about the phone there. Uh, this is all customer ordered stuff. So a little difficulty with this video. Anyway, holding a camera is not very fun. So I have pistons, you know, all this stuff customer ordered. So I was not much involved in selecting these parts. So normally I would do like the other engine there where it has the, the gold ceramic coating. It's, it's a specific piston coat coating. Now this company here, they have coated pistons as well, but these are a different kind of coating. It's a red coating. I think it's a, a fire coating, they call it something, instead of like, normally you just call it a ceramic coating, but this is supposed to be something different. Honestly, it looks almost like anodizing. I'm not very impressed. And then what else do we have here? So we got some piston rings. Looks like probably main bearings is a, what I'm guessing that is. And then a bunch of gaskets. So this Ford engine specifically, if you guys are interested in anything on that particular engine, I have that for information. If you have any questions on that engine, be sure to ask because I will be bringing out the video. Like I said, the sooner you ask, the more likely you'll see it in the sooner iteration of the videos uh this guy right here is a mercedes-benz v8 and that one is getting some cp carrillo pistons here so if you have any questions on that i'm also going to be doing a little bit of a video on that one as well so be sure to ask about that of course it's all covered now i can't really show you much of anything this one does not have coatings on it Ah, uh, they got it all stapled. I didn't open the box yet. But the pistons are in there. I did see them. They're pretty nice looking pistons. All in all, though, just wanted to make sure I got you guys knowing what I'm up to. And I haven't been bringing much videos out because I've been taking a lot of footage. And I've been so busy, I just can't. I can't. I can't edit it. I'm, I'm just too busy. Um these several inches. I just got done with a Corvette head gasket job and that job ended up being quite involved because I did more than just a head gasket. And then uh, I'm going to bring a video out on that car specifically very soon. Uh, what did I record? Oh, the supercharger. I have a video for the supercharger on that car because there's a seal replacement that needs to be done or needed to be done on it. And so I took video of that. That video probably won't come out for a little while. And then I also have, what did I... I forget. I took another video on it just recently. It's literally the video, two videos before this one on my phone. Of course, this is only 1080p, but I took a quick short video on that car for something I was fixing, and that one will be up real shortly, like within the next couple weeks. So plenty of videos coming, plenty in the works. If you have any engine questions, feel free to ask. And uh, with that, go ahead and hit the like button because I want to hear from you. Leave a comment below. I really want to hear from you. What do you want to see? What do you want to know about engines? Um, these are obviously non-LS stuff. I know a lot of you guys 
are in the, the truck world who are watching me. So, you know, if you have a truck, just because that's a different engine base than, for instance, this Mustang, let me know because I can compare that engine to this engine in the video and I can tell you the differences. So, engines are engines. They're nuts and bolts, pistons and rods. They just have a little different way of getting the air in and out, depending on the engine. Small block here. Ports are next to each other. The LS, they're spaced out. It's just different ways of getting the airflow to the tops of those pistons to compress the gas. So it, an engine's an engine. If you have any questions, let me know and uh, I'll be sure to do my best to answer all of them.